Hey y'all, for those who are a little skeptical of the Grox saying um, that Mary worship is what is bringing um, people, you know, out of the, the salvation or whatever, and you have to only trust Jesus, not Mary, um, you know, because that's what Jesus says. It's not that far-fetched because I was reading Swedenberg last night and he said the exact same thing. He says the Roman Catholic Church put Mother Mary's sainthood above the rest and set her up as the goddess or queen of all their saints. But that's that's not true. It's, it's If you're a Christian, it should be Jesus and Jesus alone. I'm just using their logic, you know. So Swedenberg confirmed it, you know, in the 1700s. So the Groxt is not out there. The Bible, Swedenberg also mentions the Bible never once has Jesus ever call Mary mother. He even calls her just woman. And once he doesn't even acknowledge her. I mean, I'm not saying he was mean to her or whatever, but he, the Bible made sure to not reference, um, to not have Jesus say mother to Mary. And it's so interesting. And, and Swedenberg actually said he talked to Mother Mary in heaven once and said, I consider, she said that she considered Jesus her son before he became God. After that, she considered him beyond flesh and all God and above her and all that. So that's what Swedenberg's spiritual, um, you know, experience says. Um, yeah, I think it kind of makes sense, you know, um, the fact that Swedenberg has confirmed that and he's confirmed experiences in heaven that correspond to the DMT trips and he's confirmed the auras and journey of souls. The, the wiser a soul is, the more purple their aura. Swedenberg says the exact same thing. The, the more innocent a soul is, you know, the, um, you get like yellows and oranges and stuff. You know, it's all, it, Swedenberg is on top of things. And he's an Aquarius rabbit. Aquarius, Aquarius rabbit like me. And William Miller's Aquarius tiger like me. All Aquariuses are two animals. I'm a rabbit and a tiger. Because the Chinese New Year's every Aquarian new moon. Anyway, so he was saying specifically Christianity was not understood until after him. He was the first to delve uh, into the metaphors of what Christianity actually means. Because um, you, you just got to read the book True Christianity. Volumes 1 and 2 are available. Um, but I'll send a PDF or a link of PDF to the whole complete thing. It's so amazing. And you need to get Philip K. Dix's exegesis book for like 7 bucks. BarnesandNoble.com has it, a cheap one, I think. Um, or just look for the used books, okay? Uh, anyway, so... Swedenberg confirms the Grox, and the Grox confirms me finding Cloud Atlas in the Matrix, and the Wachowski Brother films are all full of stuff anyway. You know, V for Vendetta, V for the Fifth Age, um, and of course the Matrix Neo, in Neo's expiration date was 9-11-2001. So, um, stuff is adding up. There's definitely something going on that involves the, the suppression of true Christianity, and that's why you can never find Swedenberg in a bookstore. You have to get it online. You can never find William Miller in a bookstore, ever. have to find it online. You can't find Philip K. Dick's exegesis in the store, just his books. You can only find it online. That means you have to know what you're looking for. Um, so yeah, it's just a little bit of suppression going on. And you can only get like one silly Maurice Cotterell book, um, not the really important ones. You got to get them online. So I think... If you do your search well, you'll have plenty of reading material to, you know, confirm your beliefs as well. I have no clue what y'all believe, but I think that in the whole scheme of things, as long as you're true to yourself and you have your own journey and be your own detective, you'll ascend, okay? Peace. Oh yeah, and the Grox also confirmed that Something I believe, something I questioned years and years ago. It was um, if if you like lived on Mars and didn't know shit about um, Christianity or whatever, would you go to hell? And Swedenberg says no. Only after you were told about Jesus um, are you held accountable. And that's crazy. So study up. Peace.